World Suicide Prevention Day on 10th September is organized by the International Association for Suicide Prevention and endorsed by the World Health Organization WHO. The event represents a global commitment to focus attention on suicide prevention. The theme of this year is creating hope through action. This reflects the need for collective action to address this urgent public health issue. All of us, family members, friends, co-workers, community members, educators, religious leaders, healthcare professionals, political officials and government can take action to prevent suicide in the region. Everybody goes through difficult times, but it is those who push through those difficult times who will eventually become successful in life. Don't give up because this too shall pass. Suicide prevention is an effort that is made to recognize the risk of suicide. It begins with identify the warning signs. One of the ways we can prevent suicide is by working to create communities in which people enjoy good mental health. This reduces the chance of people getting into difficulties that they are unable to cope with on their own. We can do this by promoting positive mental health. When we talk about a person's mental health, we are talking about how a person thinks, feels and acts in relation to life itself and in particular how they cope with life's challenges. Positive mental health describes a sense of well-being and the ability to live a full, resourceful life. Positive steps for good mental health include keep physically active, eat well, value ourselves and others, talk about our feelings with friends, family members or our doctor, care for others, keep in touch with friends and loved ones, get involved, learn a new skill, do something creative, take a break and ask for help. Today, you know, this is a very special day for all mental health professionals. Uh, this is the International World Day Against Suicide or World Day for Suicide Prevention. Uh, so, we are all um, committed to work towards suicide prevention. The theme this year is uh, creating hope through action. So, that means we have to create hope in the people through our action. Action means collaborative action. Everybody should be involved. Not only psychiatrists, psychologists, psychiatric social workers, but all, and not only psychiatric nurses, but also all nursing professionals, teachers, police, public people. Everybody has a role to play, and we also know that uh, Kerala is one of the places where we have high suicide rates. The suicide rate in Kerala is around 24. 24 means 25 people. Out of 100,000 people uh, commit suicide every year. So again, that means it comes to about 8,000 suicides in a year. And uh, the majority of the suicide are prevented. So the action should be how to prevent suicide. Suicide so prevention uh, um, starts with looking at high risk people. Who are the people at high risk to commit suicide? So, first thing is we must know that people with uh, depression, mental problems, depression, other serious mental disorders, bipolar disorders, they are very susceptible, they are like it. So, give them the mental health care, give them good care. Then, people who are next people are people who are facing social isolation. So this is the time when COVID-19 is there, people are facing COVID isolation due to the COVID-19 and then we see a lot of people, that's why there is a large number of suicides in many parts of our state and many parts of India during COVID. Then a third group of people are people who are using alcohol. In fact, I, we know that about 10% of people who are dependent on alcohol end their life in suicide. And then lastly, uh, other group will be uh, other substance use disorders and uh, that include other drugs and we can again see other groups of people who are facing job loss and also financial breakdown and uh, this includes farmers uh, who are facing problems 
So all these things are the people who are at risk people. So and then another group of people who are facing facing abuse or uh, they are threat to their security. Uh, people who are facing sexual abuse, domestic violence, so they are all susceptible to uh, suicide. They are all at high risk. Now, what are the suicide prevention strategies? You can say one include mental health, mental health in uh, mental health through primary care, mental health at every stage, improve our mental health in infrastructure, then make mental health accessible to people, and third would be reduce the access to means. For example, organ of phosphorus poison is common. The poisons which uh, people use, farmers use, and others use for uh, killing pests. So these are easily available. They should not be made easy available. Now, responsible media reporting. Media should be very. They should not uh, use uh, media to sensationalize issues. For example, dowry is a uh, social evil. We should eradicate it. But to and dowry harassment is a very wrong way because all people who face the harassment with dowry may prefer to commit suicide. So this this leads to cop, uh, copycat suicides, and then you have to fight against stigma. Uh, and these are some of the important strategies uh, that is all work together: mental health and also to prevent suicide. Thank you. Let us light a candle to show our support for suicide prevention. to remember a lost loved one and for the survivors of suicide pudiya pulari varigaya anida ini miligal niraye kanavu poomai moriyum chiriyum madhura loka is not inevitable for anyone by starting the conversation providing support and directing help to those who need it we can prevent suicide and save lives let's use this day to ask our loved ones how they are feeling and to offer support if we know someone who needs help